draw the electron dot diagram for neutral lithium. The thing you need to know about electron dot diagrams is that they only show valence electrons, only the electrons that are in the outer shell of the atom. For lithium, which is here, there are three electrons total in neutral lithium because uh, it's element number three, but the first two are in the first shell. And the third is in the second shell. So the only electron in the outer shell is that third one. The electron dot diagram for lithium then is the symbol Li, and then you put a single dot around it. Now, real chemists don't draw this diagram. It's here as a learning tool to help show how many valence electrons there are and maybe what will happen to those electrons if this reacts with something else. If you look, find my videos about Lewis structures for lithium oxide, you'll see that this metal gives its electrons away to a non-metal, and so you'll actually get to see this dot with an arrow moving to somewhere else, etc., etc. The electron dot diagram for just neutral lithium not reacting is Li with the one single valence electron drawn as a dot. Honestly, to me, it does not matter if you put it on the left, right, top, or bottom. It shouldn't matter to your teacher either, but uh, yeah, do what they say, you know what I mean? Thanks for being with me, and best of luck.